guys I want to welcome you guys back to another video today depending on how the day goes that's going to determine the the video so we got a fire going down here and we're going to try to cat, catch at least I don't know a couple of rainbow trout stick along because we're going to have a lot of fun today Alright, so I'm using, I believe this is 17 pound uh, fluorocarbon. It's been on my Revo STX for the past year, basically. I haven't really switched line out of this thing, so I'm just going to tie the uni knot because with trout, basically this setup right here is overkill <laughs> if you think about it. Trout, I usually like use like 8 pound mono, but since I have the bait caster and I'm using the lipless, I'm going to do whatever I can because today we're not trying to lose fish. So I'm tying a uni knot onto this thing. I'm gonna wet it and just cinch it down. And you guys can see I'm cinching it down. Cinch it down, slide a little bit, cinch it down. And it's not the prettiest uni knot I've tied, but with trout, I mean, it's kind of like whatever. So it's tied up. I'm gonna go cut this tag in off and we can start fishing. All right, this is like my first cast in probably close to five months, probably over five months. And this is with the new rod as well, so hopefully it don't break on me. All right, not very far, but it's so good to be fishing again. The past couple of months, I've just been hunting. So this definitely feels good to give a change to it. Alright, so we've been here for a couple hours now. I haven't had a single bite that we noticed. You can see the coals are starting to come alive. And so Josh brought some deer meat right here and also some spicy peppers. Again, we're just out here having fun, just relaxing. It's super peaceful. Alright guys, so here's the some aluminum foil. This is some um, marinated deer meat. So we're just gonna throw this on there for now. Oh man. Gotta spread stuff out a little bit. Like this. basically kind of double layered that's what we're gonna keep it for we're gonna put this on the on the whatever it is. all right so we're gonna put it with this so that way we can turn the meat a lot easier and take it out a lot easier so it goes in there perfect just squish this in like this and we're gonna tighten slide this back up to tighten it so it doesn't fall off and there we go perfection what we're gonna do is we're just gonna spread the coals out and the coals are pretty hot and we're just gonna put this in right like this and we're gonna cook to one side and then maybe like 10 minutes later we'll flip it to the other side and then it's feast mode we'll leave it like this for now
God, this is ready to go. You see that? What we're gonna do is we're gonna have to leave it here for a second because it's a little hot. All right, so here's a bowl. This is just covered in aluminum foil so we can put it there. Boom. All right, let's take this off. Why do we open on this side? The opening's on that side. There you go. Just got to take a peek. Woo! That's the barbecue sauce. See. Smells good. Woo! Wow. Would you look at that? <laughs> Ow, this smoke is killing me. Just down. All right, guys, I'm gonna take a, take a bite right here. Look at this, guys. The tail butt. That looks pretty good. Throw those in there. Yeah. All right, and it's all in there. This is so much garbage now. Ooh, about that. We good. Yeah, dude. This is some baby wipes. Comes in clutch. All right, guys. Hands are clean. We have peppers. Meat is ready to go. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for this wonderful day, Lord. Right now, uh, my brother Josh and I are here. We're here to just have fun out here, Lord. We haven't caught a fish, but you know, just spending time outdoors together is more than what we can ask for. Right now, we're about to eat uh, lunch, Lord, and we have some deer meat here. Just want to give you thanks for providing this meat for us, Lord. And as we eat, I just pray that it gives us the energy to continue to fish throughout the day, Lord. Uh, but everything we do glorifies your name, Lord. In Christ's name, pray. Amen. Hunger is how it is, man. Yeah, dude. This is the shoulder you say? Or is this is the that leg? what you say? It's like it's like the uh, it's like the bicep looks like. For sure, more more This is the leg the leg part. Oh yeah. Sure. Look at this stuff, man. You see that? Now that's bomb. Yeah, this is like falling off the mo bone. We don't even need a knife. Right, since Josh is doing that, let me dip it in some of this good old stuff right here. Right here, guys. Sorry for the lighting. Mmm. This is all provided by Josh. Ha <laughs> dude, someone did all the cooking. If you guys don't believe us how tender it is, I'm just gonna show you guys. So I'm gonna dip it in the sauce again. Like this is just a casual chew. Wow. Comes right off. Alright, we just finished eating one of the best lunches I've had in a long time. Probably just gonna kill this fire. Reel in the stuff, put a lot of stuff back in the car. So let's try and go catch a trout now. Alright, so um, I'm not gonna be bringing you guys, aka the camera obviously. I'm gonna trade you guys with this thing because we're gonna go hike, hike and fish. So I'm not gonna want to carry this big old DSLR with me. I'm going to carry light and uh, one second. If you watched my recent video of my Badlands Clutch review, and the video I said that I barely carry this little pouch by itself, well guess what? I'm doing that right now because I don't want to haul this thing with me. I'm going to unclip this one and bam, I'm just going to be carrying this little pouch with me. So I'm going to be ditching this thing and we're saying hello to this little pouch only, but I'll see you guys when we get fishing. All right, guys, we have made it. So Josh is on the lucky rock. I figured I fish over here because I have a can of soda. Throwing the lip this. See if we gonna hook one on. This is like just the perfect temperature to be outdoors. Oh, Josh is on. Yeah, let's go. At least there's fish here. Ooh, Josh got a bite. We know there's fish here.
Alright guys, made it back to the car. Went fishing for about somewhere between an hour to two hours. Josh had a bite, that was the only action we had. Come back to the car because Josh got to go to work. Josh has to go to work in a bit, so we headed out, had a blast. No fish, but it was still successful. So we'll be at, back out maybe Friday, so I'll see you guys then. Thanks for watching.